In this video I'd like to show you the market selection uh, screen stroke tool and to access it you just go up to file select market. Now fairly simple process but we've put a bit of depth behind the market selection to make your life easier. So if I clicked on select market it brings up this box you can position this wherever you wish or you can pin it to the top so that it won't disappear or you can unpin it so that it will disappear. You can select um, any market in here in the normal way that you'd select from a pick list. If I refresh the markets here I can go in and select a market and switch to the market from there. However there, are, uh, there is a lot more depth behind it. If I click on a market and want to add it to Guardian I can just click there. But if we go into the settings area this will uh, determine how the market selection screen uh, works or how it's displayed and so on. You can see here it says hide window and switching to a market. Fairly simple concept. If I double click on here, it disappears. However, there may be situations where you're using multiple screens where you don't want that to happen. So if you do, or if you untick that, then you can switch markets. In fact, we need to pin that to the top. That's my error. You can unclick that and then switch between markets and it will remain at the top of the screen for you. Expand results tree after search. It will show you in a second um, the search facility but basically if you click on search and we're looking for say a match containing Liverpool hit enter you can see it automatically expands that list out. If we untick that and go in and do the same search but we'll do it for Aston Villa and you can see you have to expand it outwards from there and as there's only one match for Aston Villa that's not um, critical, let's do Man United you can see that there are loads of markets for that uh, particular team uh, but if you do the expand results it will automatically expand it for you there you go the quick pick list, you can see this is similar to what you have seen on Guardian before, but the quick picks will automatically populate so that you can jump from one market to another. So if I want to include the Irish markets on that uh, list, rather than having to select or search, I can just go to the quick picks menu and bring up any of the markets from there and switch to the market from there. So you can see there's quite a few um, facilities there that allow you to jump backwards and forwards between markets and you can see if I use the next market function here um, that will skip forward uh, to the next available market in fact we need to go somewhere like here and that will um, flick forward and jump to the next available market within the screen so you can search in the manner which you've been used to in the past which is basically go down this list and look for individual items. You can search by a string so um, if I search by a particular race um, let me think Goodwood is tomorrow isn't it? You can see you can do that. You can have pick lists available and there are a number of characteristics which you can change by going to the settings screen. So that's the market selection window for you.